why a project the study of mathematics is essential for everyday to everyday life it pervades almost every aspect of our daily activities planning a picnic baking a cake comparing performances on a 100 in a 100 meter race shopping for groceries all require applying mathematical concepts and principles to investigate, describe, explain, or predict some real-world phenomena. However, to those engaged in learning mathematics in secondary schools, the links between mathematics and the real world are often not recognized or at least not identified and practiced. The purpose of a project is to end encourage students to apply mathematical concepts, skills, and procedures to investigate, describe, and explain real-world phenomena, to practice problem-solving, and to evaluate results. And these experiences are to be realized by encouraging all students to 1. Define problems in personal ways, especially by how the problems were motivated. Two, discuss the problems with A, their teacher, B, their classmates, and C, their parents and knowledgeable adults. Three, develop ways of solving the problems of interest of and of curiosity. Four, Record the problems and the ways they would attempt to find solutions using words, symbols, diagrams, charts, tables, figures, models, and algorithms. 5. Develop positive attitudes towards the method of mathematics, use of mathematics, and the enjoyment associated with Knowing mathematics and solving mathematical problems. And six, extend mathematical processes and products to exploring and understanding other subjects on the school curriculum. Hmm. So that's just why some reasons they give as to why a project. But anyway. Simple areas of research may include higher purchase or cash, an explanation of the advantages and disadvantages of higher purchase using data collected from at least two stores. Okay. Sports utility vehicles versus cars. Comparative analysis of the cost of different types of vehicles considering fuel economy, maintenance and features. What features should be included in your project? Explaining one explaining the mathematical ideas contained in your project. Explaining the mathematical ideas. Right. Two, carrying out practical tasks using one of the following methods: ruler, compasses, and protractor. Drawing, constructing, and measuring. Counting, looking for patterns, weighing calculators, computers, and other technological devices are some of the features. Third feature, performing calculations mentally with pencil and paper or, with, or by using calculators. Four, responding orally to mathematics questions asked by the teacher, peer, or other interested persons orally. I would want to ask now, would that would the submission of an SBA include an audio recording since you talk about responding orally? Hmm. Five, identifying sections of project which A are to be done inside normal class time and scheduled by a teacher. 
and B, may be done outside normal class time at students' convenience. Main activities for the project. Stating the task. You wish. There will H I C H. Guess it would should have been double I S H. You wish to undertake this nature, scope and focus. Two planning. What you will do, how you will do it, what materials you will need, what procedures you will use. Three, carrying out the plan, procedures, or activities. So you plan it, then carry it out. Four, you record what you did, how you did it, and why you did what you did using words, including mathematical words and phrases. Diagrams, tables, figures, and our charts. Then five, conclusion, showing your findings, your comments on your findings, how to improve your findings, making your findings more useful. Hmm. All right. Then they talk about se seven strategies that students use when they are searching for solutions to problems in mathematics. They use simple numbers. They replace original numbers with very simple numbers and try to find a solution. After the solution has been found, they try the solution with the original numbers. So let's see, they replace the original numbers with very simple numbers and try to find a solution. After the solution they have been found, they try the solution with the original numbers. So that sounds like looking at a situation where you have very complicated figures. You make a model simplified model using simple numbers see if it works then you go back to using since if it works then you can go back to using the original complicated numbers to solve the real problem sounds like that using simple numbers all right two sketch a simple diagram attempt to understand the problem using your insight from geometry and the physical arrangements of the spaces around you. So that has to do with sketching, drawing. Third, you make a table of results. You try to discover any pattern within the table. You may reduce the size of the table, rotate the table and view its contents from a second perspective. Mm -hmm. That's a table, making a table. Then there is Guess and check. I guess you would guess what might happen and then check to see if there is consistency in your assumptions and guess. Five, look for patterns. Try to create patterns by combining numbers in novel ways. Six, use algebraic symbols to express ideas. Algebraic symbols to express ideas, okay. That's using written symbols instead of writing out in plain English. Seven, make full use of calculators. You explore number ideas, number patterns, and number sense. Highlight estimation skills associated with arithmetic operations like multiplying, dividing, and finding square root. Highlight estimation skills. All right. Check calculations associated with a wide range of applications from real life. Calculations associated with applications from real life. I guess you use a calculator to verify them. And D, focus on the process associated with problem solving and there is the assessment criteria so the project will be presented in the form of a report and will have the following parts project title introduction method of data collection presentation of data analysis of data discussion of findings 
and conclusions. It will be marked over a total of 20 and the marks will be allocated to each task and profile as outlined below, which we will come to soon, later.